Praise the Lord, my fellow brothers and sisters in Christ. It's your boy Abdul here at Memo G Investor, which is Man of God Investor family. You know, uh, just 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 been so tired, so exhausted. I just been trying to get caught up on some sleep. So I thank you all for lifting me up in prayer, uh, keeping me in your thoughts and prayer. Um, but I feel better. I feel good. So I wanted to get on here. I'm gonna do a two videos today for y'all. Um, but um, just a quick update. In regarding the wealth transfer and what's going on in the market is the cryptocurrency been 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 crashing. You know, even the stock market been going down. And today, actually, there's the CPI report to see where we stand as far as the inflation numbers. I don't have those numbers in front of me because I'm out. Obviously, I haven't had the time to check it out yet. I'm heading home in a few minutes. But uh, cryptocurrency been crashing. I know some of y'all seen the the Shiba price it dropped down. It actually gained another zero. It had four zero. So last time I looked at it, we had five zeros. The price was like five zero nine one or something like that. So just to explain what's going on, I don't know if y'all ever heard of FTX, which is an exchange, um, kind of like a kind of like a Coinbase, Crypto.com, Uphold, all those other things, right? This one based in the U.S. and you've seen commercial on it all over. If you if you if you watch the Super Bowl and things like that, you'll see you have seen some commercial about ftx so they have some liquidity issue which is not a good thing and you know they've been selling off a lot of their cryptocurrency and they've been halting people from trading and it's just so much nonsense and negativity going on which caused a massive uh crash this is what you actually call a flash crash when you know overnight you see pretty much every single crypto go down 15 20 30 40 even 50 percent like Solano was one of those cryptocurrency that's uh, when I seen it happen, it was down like 55 percent, which is ridiculously crazy. That's a lot. FTX, has, they have their own coin and that one is down. It was down like 80 percent at the time when I looked at it. it was it was at like 18 dollars. And last night before I went to bed, it was at like two dollars and thirty nine cents. <laughs> Just some crazy things going on. Um Y'all probably don't know who CZ is. If you do know who CZ is, then you're experiencing the crypto space. CZ is the owner of Binance, which is one of the top three cryptocurrency who has his own exchange. He was going to buy it off, but, you know, he obviously he, he decided not to do it because he said the situation just out of hand. There's nothing he can do to help it solve it. But um, last update I seen was they're they're trying to figure out a certain way to get the situation fixed. But it's not a good look, and it caused a lot of panic, and it caused a lot of selling from within the uh, exchange. And the part that suck is so anybody that has FTX, you you've been you are being withheld from withdrawing and and selling and things like that. Everything is halted now. That, I, that's the whole point of this video that I'm making, y'all. This is the reason why I'm not really a big fan. Even though I do use Coinbase a little bit, um, Crypto.com is my favorite one out of all of them. But personally, I like to use uh, a Web3 wallet. Either use MetaMask, which is a hot wallet, or you could do a cold wallet like the Yodano Ledger. Those are safer things. Uh, you can never be halted from trading, moving, and doing things like that. So some of y'all that have FTX, man, I, 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 my heart goes out to you. I pray to, for you. I don't know I don't know if y'all experienced anything like that. If you did, let me know in the comment, family. Um but it caused a lot of a uh, lot of the pricing to go down, especially some of our favorite prophetic coins like Shiba Inu, even Luna Classic, XRP. I mean, every single coin went down. Those coins literally just ran up like over 140 percent and it went back where it was down to seven cents again. Um, am I panicking? OK, look, I'm not I don't give financial advice. That's not what I do here, family. I just come here. I give you information and then I share my thoughts on what I'm doing. I'm not panicking. I always look at these things as opportunities to buy more. Now, only thing that I'm bummed at is that I don't have extra money to buy any more cryptocurrency because I have a life and I have responsibilities that I need to take care of. That comes first. So once I get that taken care of, I am praying that the Lord keep these prices down here for the next two to three weeks because I would like to buy more Shiba. would like to buy some XRP, Solano, and so on and so on. So many cryptocurrency that I would like to buy. So far, uh, for, so, um, as far as the wealth transfer in Shiba Inu with the, with the price going down, don't panic. Everything is down. This is part of the journey. <laughs> this is how cryptocurrency, I can't tell you how many times I have seen this happen in the course of the last two and a half years. I have literally seen uh, the same coins go like uh, go crazy and then crash like 40, 30%. Um, 
Ethereum, which is one of my absolute favorite cryptocurrency, it, it literally shot all the way up to like 1600. It looked like it was about to go to 1700. Last night it went all the way down to 1100. I'm hoping it goes down to $900, $800. Would love to buy more. But personally, for me, if I had money, I would be buying some Ethereum, some Shiba Inu, and whatever else the Lord I feel led. All right. And uh, um, so I just wanted to come on here just to let y'all know real quick that everything is still perfectly fine. Nothing to worry about. Don't panic. Um, if you can, if you, if you, well, I'm not even going to speak on that. To me, if I could have bought more, I would have bought more. I don't tell you what to do. That's completely up to y'all. All right. Uh, so tonight I'm going to make another video tonight. I want to talk about a, uh, a cryptocurrency. It's not necessarily a prophetic coin. I haven't received any prophetic uh, confirmation, but I will say it is one of those coins that has the Shiba Inu potential. Imagine if you could have got into Shiba Inu when it was only at like 40,000, 40 million market cap and then ride it all the way to like the, the billions that it's sitting at now or the all time high was like forty five billion dollars. Right. So I'm, I'm going to bring one of those opportunities to the channel tonight. I'm going to talk about it a little bit and I'm going to show you all where it's available if you all was interested on in getting it. Do I have any? Um, I had some, but, you know, obviously certain things came up. Uh, I had to pay bills and things like that. So I sold it, but I do plan on buying more. In fact, I might show y'all how to do it tonight. Um, so stay tuned for that one family. I appreciate it. I don't have my Bible. You know how I love to do my uh, word of the day. Um, so I'm going to do that tonight. But before I go, though, I want to encourage every single one of y'all to stay in your prayer closet. All right. That's the message that I have right now is stay within your prayer closet closet that means be close draw unto god seek after his goodness his mercy his grace be in one communion in the holy spirit knowing that jesus christ will never leave you nor forget nor forsake you all right god is there at all time no matter how hard the situation is your car may break down but god will never break down and leave you stranded he'll always make a way for you all right you might be over here working nonstop to keep your bills paid, but don't worry. A brighter future is coming where you can vacation whenever you want, where you can have your private jet or whatever that it is for you that you need to do everything. But guess what? Stay focused in God. Stay, uh, stay, stay in communion with God. Stay in your prayer closet. But most importantly, when this wealth transfer does happen, when it does happen, keep in mind that wealth that you're receiving is not your wealth, but instead it is the wealth of the kingdom of heaven. So it is our responsibility to use that wealth to continue to grow the kingdom, to travel all over the world and preach, preach the gospel of Jesus Christ, to go on to all of the homeless people, to give them clothes and find them places to stay, to try to help them recover. For the, the, those that are needy, we, we are the helping hand to provide that necessity need that they need to help them out. But it is not of our own strength. It is not of our own will, but it is by the strength of God and the will of God. So remember that the wealth that we're getting is not for us. It is for the kingdom of God. And of course, you pray, you seek you the kingdom of heaven and everything else shall be added unto you. All of these things we need. We need food. We need clothes. We need shelter. We need all of these stuff. All right. The Lord going to give us everything that we need. And then some. Even to the part of pleasure. It's okay to have great things that you enjoy. Like hobbies. Let's say like for me. I love Corvette. I will own me a Corvette. And I'm not ashamed to saying that. I love me a Corvette. And I would love to get me a nice truck. A, 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 Sha a Tahoe truck. I would love to have my Corvette, which is going to be my fun car, enjoying my car. And I would love to get me a Tahoe truck, which is going to be a family truck on my daily commute and maybe get an electrical car. Uh, who knows? So do not be ashamed of that. All right. Now, once you start to get greed to me, I, I, I do find it is you don't need to have a million dollar car. If, if that's what you want to do, I mean, cool. I don't need all of that. A Corvette is not a million dollar car. It's, it's like a hundred thousand dollar car. Sure. Sure. It sounds crazy. But if the Lord bless me with millions and millions of dollars, I am not ashamed to tell you that I will buy me a Corvette. You better believe it. I have no shame in my game and I'm not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ because I know if it wasn't for the Lord, I wouldn't be able to get that. So anyways, family. I love y'all. I just wanted to share that. Do a quick little video, man. Look, when the spirit keeps going, man, I guess be talking. I wasn't even trying to make no 10 minute video, but I just wanted to say thank you all for keeping me in your prayer. I feel good. I feel restored. I feel more energetic. I feel ready to make a video for y'all tonight and to do the word of the day for tonight, even though I just pretty much did a word of the day today just now so family like the video subscribe to the channel if you're looking for a biblical concept channel where we talk about investment stocks whatever it is even though i haven't said anything about stocks yet uh, 
I, I will get into it. I promise. I just love crypto so much. But yes, this is the channel for you. So subscribe, family. Let's do this. Let's get be prepared for the wealth transfer and uh, share this with some friends and family. Y'all stay blessed and be encouraged in Jesus' mighty name. I'm out.